worry. This is for you. Come on, gorgeous lad. Hello, sweetheart. Right, hi guys. Um, you may have seen from the title of this video or if you follow me on Instagram that today is actually a bit of a sad day. Um, Jaffa is going to sadly fly the nest and go off to his new home. Surprisingly, I'm feeling weirdly okay about it and that is because I know we have found him the most perfect home we could have ever possibly have asked for. <laughs> Jaffa's taking it really seriously as you can see. So last week we had had a lovely girl called Abby come out and view him. She's 16 and she's looking for a pony to sort of produce, to do some eventing with, and also for her mum to ride a bit. So Jaffa couldn't fit the bill more perfectly really. He's flashy enough to be a competition pony, but he's also just so sweet and genuine that you could put your mum on him to hack him out. So we're really lucky to find him such a perfect home. So she had him vetted yesterday, which he sailed through and they are currently on their way to come and pick him up and take him to your new abode. Becky, do you have any words? No words. <laughs> it is a bit sad, but we are, we're feeling okay about it, aren't we? It did have to be done. As you all know, we did buy Jaff to be a project and he was basically too easy. That's why he's not actually been here that long. We couldn't really justify keeping him any longer because he's just been an absolute angel. He is ready to go and make someone else very, very happy. <laughs> I want more carrots. But he's been an amazing pony to work with. We've all really, really enjoyed it. And it's safe to say he is absolutely touched our hearts and he will not be forgotten. But the amazing thing about him going to Abby is that she's active on Instagram and she's a really lovely girl and I know she'll stay in touch. So we'll be able to follow exactly what he's getting up to. She's a fantastic little rider. So I know that she's gonna do an amazing job with him and produce you to be an absolute superstar. I'll probably really regret selling you in about three months. <laughs> but that's the way it is, good boy. I thought I'd make just a quick video to show some of Jaffa's best bits and sort of his journey since he's been with us. We got him in November and it's now coming towards the end of March. It's Corona time for people that are watching this, maybe in a year's time. I hope we're out of self-isolation by then. Comment below if you're watching in a year's time and we're still isolating, because that will not be fun. It's been amazing to work with. He was really, really easy to sort of back and break. We've not actually done any competing because it's been quite a tricky time of year. We've had loads of flooding and then obviously this virus has come around. So in terms of competition experience, he's not really got any, but he is ready as soon as this virus goes to go out and compete and have some fun with. Anyway, I will pass over to when we first bought him at the sales and take you on a little journey from November to March. And then I'll introduce you to Abby and we'll film him loading and going off to your new home. Hey, lovely. Good boy. Oh, my God. That's not bad. So. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, <laughs> 
my god, he said there's another pony! Things we do for horses. I'm my pyjama top. <laughs> right, Becky! <laughs> appreciate the star of the show literally walked up to it bit it to make sure it was cool and then just walked on Hope you enjoyed seeing those little clips of Jaffa's journey. I'm not going to put too many in because I don't want it to be too emotional and I know after Jaffa goes and I'm sat this evening trying to edit this, it's going to be hard. So it's compressed and yeah, just a few of his best bits since he's been here. But he certainly touched our hearts and we will not be forgetting about you anytime soon, little ginger man. He's not going too far away and there is actually talk of them moving to this neck of the woods maybe one day. So. Who knows, maybe Jaffa will be local again and we'll be able to see you. So Jaff, say a little goodbye to the vlog before your new owners come and get you. Say bye bye. Oh God, you're so cute. I know he's touched all of your hearts, so make sure you go and follow Abby and you'll be able to check up on his progress. I'll put her Instagram tag on the screen now and I'll also link below or if you go onto my Instagram which is Elphic Event Ponies um, there will be a post of Jaffa going and I will tag Abby in that post so you can go and follow him and see how he's getting on so now it's the case of waiting for them to arrive I'll get a little clip of him going on the lorry and then sadly that is going to be the last time you see Jaffa on my vlogs I'm afraid guys good boy Jaffa love you see you in a bit Oh God, <laughs> strangling me. <laughs>
Tokyo Never easy, but it's going to a lovely, lovely home. Honestly, cannot stress how friendly and nice and amazing those people are. So really, really happy that he's going somewhere so nice and he's gonna really look after him and enjoy him and make him into even more of a wonderful pony. So that is the silver lining of it all. And people always ask me, it's like, how do you do it? How do you part with them? And it's honestly that, it's making sure we find them the best possible homes. I cannot stress how many inquiries I had about Jaffa, as you probably know. Um, so yeah, it's it's a really nice position to be in because you kind of sift through everyone and you can just find the best possible home where they're gonna be the happiest. And that's kind of, that's how I do it. it. It, yeah, it makes this bit easier knowing that they're gonna be well looked after and really, really happy. Anyway, oh, you can see him going up on the, I can't see. You can see the lorry there. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, anyway, I'm going to end this vlog here. I only wanted it to be short and sweet, but I know people will want to know where he's gone. And, yeah, as difficult as it is to kind of make, it's... I feel like I owe it to you guys, and especially as Jaffa has touched so many hearts, I feel like it was only fair to make a bit of a vlog, same where he is. Um, but thank you for watching. I hope the next vlog is going to be slightly more upbeat. Ugh. Yeah, it's a difficult time. You right, Mum? Yeah. <laughs> it's horrible, sad. isn't it? When they were driving off, I was like, <coughs> just stop it. Don't, don't you dare cry. We're not having, we're not doing it again. Oh, Bye. See you next time. You're on your way to conquer your fears In this dream of your own decide There is someone calling your name Love is forever Love is forever To believe you gotta let go Light as a feather Light as a feather Yo.